Hi, I'm Metal Scott, and I stole from my mom's purse. <laughs> and I'm Cody. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> so, Cody... Cody managed to get himself a new... Well, new to him, Mesa Boogie dual caliber DC-5. Dual um, caliber. It's just a dual caliber or a DC-5. Yeah. It's a 50 watt amp head, all two. All two. Um, and we just did a review on Just Ahead, so if you just want to check that out, it'll be another video. All tube, all hot. It's hot in here. Yeah, it is, actually. I'm going to turn the fan on. Actually, um, the mic might catch that. Okay, so, we so we're just going to heat bur uh, burn alive. We're, we're um, going to die in here. <clears throat> these... So we thought we'd do a separate video instead to just compare the two Mesa Boogie heads he has. Now, unfortunately, there's no water allowed in the band room, so uh, if we die in here, it's probably too late. Don't even bother trying to call 911. We're, al we're already dead. Yeah, by the time this video comes out, I don't know how it came out. I don't know either. Yeah. Oh, well, so if you don't see the video, we're probably dead. But how would they know that we were They dead? don't! <laughs> So, so we're going to compare right here the Mesa Boogie F50 to the Mesa Boogie Dual Caliber 5. And we're currently cool. plugged into the DC5. Yes. But I don't know if the speaker is running into that one. I thought you were talking about this video. Uh, everything's everything's on. We're good. Yeah, we're, okay. Um, we're all open. We're open for business. Baby. And before we get started, remember, we're Robot Romance. We make videos all the time. We do all kinds of music stuff. We are a band, so we make songs. This episode brought to you by Dollar Shave Club, of which Scott is subscribed to. And I clearly am not, for I have not shaven in several days. That being said, we're not actually brought to you by Dollar Shave Club, but if you ever want to hit us up, let us know, because I'll definitely sponsor you. I use you anyway. That's fair. And so does Dominic. Also Subway. If Subway, if Subway wants to give us a subscription. Three quarters of the band currently uses Dollar Shave Club. You don't you don't even like Subway. But I love Subway. I, I would use Subway. Hashtag not sponsorship. sponsored. Let's do this. Hashtag so, please sponsor us Subway. Okay. So or Jimmy John's. Let's hit it. Give us some of that Mesa Boogie Clean. This is the DC5. You learn a bunch of open chords, and you're just like, oh, okay, I know how to play these. <laughs> Foot switch. Shave Club, <laughs> brought to you by uh, Subway. Uh, only, only three ninety nine. Get the best shave 
and, of, of your dreams. And when you're all done, go on, go on over to Target, get yourself a copy of Super Mario Odyssey. It's, it's fifty nine ninety nine. It's Super Mario Odyssey. how it seems so let's let's play a little more and then we'll swap it over Seven very nices, and I rate this uh, also seven very nices. For different reasons. So we're screwed. This is going to be a fun version. <laughs> One thing that's really nice about the um, the DC5 is it comes with a foot switch, whereas we don't currently have one for the uh, F50. Yeah, but we also don't know how to change the channel without the foot switch on, on the, the DC5. Which you'll uh, you'll notice if you watch the other video. We'll so we'll figure it out. Why don't we give us some some nice dirty tone? sound quite as clear as the DC-5. Yeah. But it sounds more aesthetically pleasing? I... Uh, okay, so what I want you to do next is give me some lead tones, but here's what I'm getting so far. Yeah. The... The yeah. DC-5, just like on the... So, like, it had the same problem between the clean and the, and the distorted, which makes perfect sense. It handles... Like, the DC-5 was bassier and less chimey. Which meant it handled chugging so much better. It was a massively different sound. It sounded more powerful. Yeah. Um, whereas the F50 was just a completely different. You know, had the it was much higher in the highs. Uh, but one thing that I really like about the DC5 that isn't on the F50 is the DC5 has this frequency band EQ over it's here. He's pointing to the EQ band, which and shown a clip. <sighs> And, um, yeah, the, the EQ band is more focused. Yeah, it gives you more control. Control over it. Way yeah. more control over the sound, whereas, like, we're not going to be able to get those. St I feel like if we really worked at the DC-5, we could get the same sound. 
but better. Or very similar. Yeah. And I feel like we can't do that with the F-15. That makes sense. Um, so that's my current thoughts. Uh, so why don't you give me some lead tones, just like solos and stuff on, on the F-50, and then I'll trade you over. Okay. <laughs> accidentally left the booster on on the dc5 so we're nice. gonna give you a couple more clean tones well no let's go to lead and then we'll give them more cleans because we just did lead so talk to dirty Thank <laughs> you. 
can't hit that fucking... <laughs> Song. I, I like the. I don't know why we don't. There you go. <laughs> okay. <sighs> All right. So. tell you the truth like just listening to these I definitely like the DC5 better like why is that in all fronts um I like the fact that it's got a booster on the clean channel that's fantastic yeah that's pretty cool. um I like that if I want to time your sound I can tune tone it in and you know just crank up the high frequencies it's fine we yeah. totally get it and then um the, the distorted sound is just so thick. It's a lot better. And it just, it makes me feel like if I had these two amps, the DC5 would make me want to play. Whereas the F50 just kind of like, it's there and I'm glad I have it. So if I want to play, I could play and it sound good. Yeah. But like the DC5, I would like wake up in the morning and forget to take a shower because I ran into the room to go play on the DC5. I will say this. I like the Queens on the F50 a little bit more. But I like the distortion, which I use significantly more on the DC5, like a lot better. If it came down between the two, I'd probably pick the DC5 over the F50. Just because I use the distortion more. Which is fair. Yeah. If any of you guys have a clear favorite or just want to point out some things that maybe we missed, let us know in the comments. We read them every day. I do. He checks them frequently. Every so often. Yeah. So let us know in the comments if there's anything you want us to do. Uh, we have to be able to afford it. We're not sponsored like we said we were. We're not. And um, I have a dollar in my bank account right now. I'm so broke. So, uh, so send us money. <laughs> we, we don't have anything for them to do that to. No. Uh, we don't have a Patreon. We don't. Well, I have a PayPal. But yeah, we do. We both have. We, Anyways, we both have a PayPal. we're not going to give out our PayPal. I didn't think you would have a PayPal. Well, yeah. Thanks for watching. We're Robot Romance. I'm Metal Scott. That's Cody. And uh, it's been fun. The one rule of video stuff is never look at the camera. <laughs>